What's up all my dragonlings, I am the Dragon Guy Gaming, Damien Dragon, and welcome back to another episode of Ty the Tasmanian Tiger 2, well, Ty Tasmanian Tiger 3, Night of the Quaken. Now, um, what we got in store for you guys today is we have to go down here, excuse me, pardon me, but I should, again, I'm going to start doing this at the beginning of each episode. If you guys wait until the last 20 seconds of each episode, you guys will see, um, the, um, last episode of Kai where we figured out that Kai was a monster in this freaking thing. So, you guys want to go check that out the last 20 seconds. So, we will have this problem at the end of the video. Also, at the end, hit the subscribe button! Please consider subscribing. Oh god! Alright. So... I need to go down here. Okay. And no! That is so cute how it, it goes. Okay. I want to do that one down there, all the way down there. Okay, I really don't need these that bad. Where am I going? Okay. Okay, now I'm on the right track. Cockatiel way. Okay, come on. That has to be deliberate. That has to be deliberate. Already. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's actually go and do our mission. <laughs> Ty! Previous owner was a little old lady who only used it on Sundays. See you, Ty. A little old lady that used a satellite strike? What the fuck? Is that the gun yet? Yo, Sly! What's good, homie? So, bro, you ready to jump out of a speeding jet, riding a three-ton mechanical bunyip to battle the Quinky Commander, a vicious fighting machine that we know nothing about, who is threatening an entire town? So what? That would be the place where I would say, No! No, I am not! That's just me. So I'm fighting a commander. 
Oh yeah, I got the shadow beam now. <laughs> Good lord! I like the original version. I really do. Why do I like the original version? It's because it the beam is a lot more better. So I like the original gun yet a lot more. Okay. Well, it looks like there's something over there, so I, I should get that. Ooh. Okay. This also worries me quite a bit. A water stone. Excellent. Awesome. I don't need to get everything. That's fine. All you need to do is win. Oh my god. Oh, they're back. <laughs> Immediately two down. I like how they made sure the first two did not matter. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll get to all of you. No worries, no worries, no rush. I want these. Okay, so the first two did matter. Okay. Oh! 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 Looks like I can come back here. I'm not dying a painful death, and I do not appreciate it. Okay, there is a painful death. Excellent. Now I'm happy. Now I'm happy. Next. A 
Okay, keep on throwing them at me. I'll drag it to the whole them down for you. I have no problem. I will shadow beam you to that. I don't care how many of this of you there are. Oh wait, if you excuse me for a minute, I, I'm gonna need one thing. Thank you. He's like, I hit him! Yay! And then realizes, oh, he may have just hit him. Dude, I, I'm sorry, but... Suck. I'm the type of person that loves to be super overpowerful. And not for the reasons you think. Huh. Oh. Okay. So what the fuck's over? Okay, so I can't go through there. Got it. I see the boss! Okay, I get it. Damn. Okay. Okay, got him. Okay, so I get it. Okay! Oh my god. This is annoying. Okay. Haha, <laughs> you did it. Those Quinkin won't mess with us again. And with that Quinkin commander gone, I think we've seen our last threat at New Borough Gee, I hope so, Sly. I've got a funny feeling I'll be back here soon.
I mean, with all due respect to this game. Fine. The Klingon have launched an aerial assault on some country towns. You have to get over there quick and put an end to it. Hurry up. Yeah, of course. Um... But with all due respect to this game, and regardless of how you feel about this game, I kind of feel like they, you know, shoehorned in a lot of stuff for no reason. Like, no reason besides, like, hey, this this is going to be so random. You know what I mean? Like, there, there's no need for that one. Alright, we're, we're at 15. I don't want to, like, go underneath, like, 20. Or 30. We'll, we'll just go up and, we'll, we'll just go out and do, uh... That mission. Um, but for the sake of the game, like, yeah, I love the series. I, I love Sly. Well, I love Ty. Sorry, not Sly. Sly Cooper is one of my favorites. Sorry. I've been saying Sly and Ty so much that I'm thinking like Sly Cooper and shit. For, but for how much I love um, Ty the Tasmanian Tiger. Um, I think this game feels a little more shoehorned. Like, they... Like, somehow it's a little more unfinished. And, like, some of the jokes are just shoehorned in to make it... You know... Air quote... Air quote, unquote, like... So random. You know what I mean? Like, it, it does not... It does not need to be like that. Of course, like, some of the original jokes from, like, Ty 1 and 2, like, you can understand their jokes, and that's fine. Right? You can get, like, hey, this is, this is how this is supposed to be. This is how it wants to be. You know what I mean? And it's going to be like that regardless of what everyone thinks. And, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I'm like, I'm not saying that it should not be, like, you know, hey, let me, let me show you on some some random jokes, you know, like, yeah, you can, you can do that, but I mean, like, you're forcing it, you know, and it's trying to be funny for the sake of, you know, art, you know what I mean, like, it does not need to be so random. Like, Ty's character feels a little more forced than anything else. Like, he was a little more fleshed out in, um, 1 and 2. Like, you know what he was, you know his mission, you get it. And then some of the jokes were like, okay, it's there for the sake of comedy. And, like, some of the jokes, uh, it feels there. Now they're just doing it for the comedic effect. And, like, it doesn't work. Another water stone? But you, you see my point. Like, I'm not just harshly criticizing the game. It just feels like they ran out of ideas and then shoehorned a lot of the plot inside. Just for the effect and make the game feel a little more whole. It does not need to be like that. It does not need to be that way. Sir, things were starting to look grim for New Baramudgee with all those fortresses flying about. You've got to come. Quickly, sir. Uh, what am I doing? No time to explain. Just come with me. Like, you get the picture. Like, some of these characters did not have a plot. Like, look at, um... Now, look at this guy. acquainted with the gunner, shall we? She's the fastest and most maneuverable bird in the bush rescue fleet. Equipped with both air-to-air -air and air-to-ground munitions capabilities. Okay. You should have no worries taking on even the hardest of evil spirit invasions. In you hop. Uh, shouldn't I have a go on a simulator or something first? There's no time. Besides, there's no simulation like the real thing, sir. You'll get the hang of it. Okay. Do you see what I mean? Someone like, uh... Like him who didn't have, like, a small story around him or you didn't know how annoying he was at the beginning. 
it feels forced. Destroy the six quake and flying fortresses as quickly as possible. Watch out for the spider queen guarding the quinkin flying fortress and all the incoming quinkin armies. To see the gunner patrols go to the pause menu. What's going to happen? Like, what is even going on? Like there's no, there's like, I, I feel like there's no need. Like this feels very full. Like, you don't need to have this type of stuff. Like, again, it feels forced. Like, it does not need to be there. Like this, it feels, again, very poor. I just don't get it. Again, these things feel shoehorned in because, I mean, they can. Like, Rome, come on now. I knew you could do it, sir. We showed those quinkin' what's what, hey? Yeah, I still wish you'd have showed me what's what first. Another Firestone. I don't need another Firestone. Me again! Fuck you. Hi, it's worse than I feared. 
Until now, we'd only heard of the Quinken attacking New Baramaji. But we've started getting reports of devastation from all over Southern Rivers. We can't get help to anyone, though, because of this big meanie they call Hexacrit. He thinks he runs the place and won't let anyone leave the area. Could you go and show him that I'm the one in charge? More along the lines of, Bitch, I'm the one in charge. I need you to realize that. I'm in charge. But, yeah, I think that's enough for today. Um, tomorrow will be the live stream. And again, as I promised, I was going to do another episode of Minecraft because a lot of you guys seem to like Minecraft. And guys really seem like to enjoy seeing it. Like, you guys have a hand in what I build and, um, what I got in store for everyone. So, I've, I've done a lot of, you know, maintenance on the game. So, maybe you guys will like what, I, what you see. Who knows? Next, next time we go back in, I'm going into the nether. And I want to explore just a little bit of the nether, seeing if I've never done it. So, that's what we're going to actually do. So, I hope everyone enjoyed today. This was a lot of fun, but... There's always... There's always, there's always got to be an end to an episode, but that's okay. Um, but today I really har harshly criticized Ty, but I do love the games. I mean, this game less than the first two, but I do enjoy Todd Tasmanian Tiger. Um, maybe it's because of, you know, it's so sim similar to Sly, Sly Cooper, that I, um... I took an immediate liking to like the game, the aesthetic, you know, the funny, you know, wacky back and forth between the characters. But I feel like in this game it's a little more forced than absolutely anything else. It feels like you're forced to say like, hey, it's just being random for the sake of being random, you know. But that doesn't make a good game. That makes you know, it makes it feel like it, it's shoehorning it into your face, and that's not good. But like at least in the other games, the uh, the, the action was prevalent, but, you know, the, the humor, you know, was more subtle. In this game, it just, it's in your face consistently, so it, it did not need to be. So, I'll probably touch on more, more of that next time, but, um, let me know down in the comment section below what you guys think. Um, very soon I'm probably going to do a top 10 of, like, the best ranks from these, the series. So, who knows? We have something. At the top of the episode, as I said, on the left-hand side of the screen, at the last 20 seconds, there will be the last episode of Ty on this side, over here, down at the bottom. And the subscribe button will be over here, so go check that out if you guys have not. And click on it, and help me hit 400 subscribers. Let me know down in the comments below, as I said, who's your favorite character, and I cannot wait to play another board episode. So anyway... Good gaming, happy hunting, and I'll see all you dragonlings back inside the world of Ty. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time for some more Game Dragon action. Peace.